Hi there, my name is Valera, I'm a professional pyramid player and in this video I will tell you the rules of the game and even if it's not as popular in the world as snooker or pool, it is much more exciting than you think it is. It's a 12 foot surface, the same size as a snooker table. There are 16 balls in the game of pyramid and only one of them, the cue ball, is colored. It's usually red or yellow. The rest of the balls are white and numbered. The numbers though don't mean anything. You can see that in comparison with pool balls and snooker balls, pyramid balls are heavier and bigger and the pockets are tighter. There are three major types of pyramid game. The first type I'm going to tell you about is called free pyramid, also known as American pyramid. In order to win, you have to pocket eight balls. So the first player who pockets eight balls wins the frame. Any ball may be used as a cue ball. Most importantly, in the game of Pyramid, you're welcome to pocket not only object balls, but also cue balls. Pyramid is the only form of pocket billiards that allows that. If you miss your shot, it's your opponent's turn to make a shot and to start his break. The second type is Dynamic Pyramid, also known as Nafsky Pyramid. In this game, only the colored ball can be the cue ball, and in case you pocket the cue ball, you take the cue ball out of the pocket and you can place it anywhere on the table. At the same time, you must choose any object ball to be taken off the table. For example, in this situation, I'll choose this one. But you may not pocket the cue ball until the next stroke. So after pocketing the cue ball, the next pocketed ball must be an object ball. Otherwise, it is a fool. The third type is combined pyramid, also known as Moscow pyramid. In this game, only one ball is a cue ball. After you pocketed the cue ball, you have to take it out of the pocket, then you have to choose any object ball to be taken off the table, let's say this one. Then the cue ball, you have to place it anywhere between the head rail, the bottom cushion and head, but not on top of that line. And from here until the next stroke, the balls can only be pocketed in the side pockets or far corner pockets, but not in these ones. In pool, this part of the table is called the kitchen, and in pyramid, we call it the house. So now you know what pyramid game is and how to play it. Enjoy the game and have a great day!